my name is Anders Jensen. Let's learn some UiPath. Today we will see how we can open one file in a folder, how we can open more files in a folder, and finally how we can open all files in a folder. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. That will help me a lot. With that said, let's go on. So I created some files here in a folder. I got some Excel sheets, I got some Word documents, some text documents, and a PowerPoint presentation. Say that we only want to open this Word document, then we will just use a start process. So drag that in. We will need to type in the executable path, uh, shift right click on the file, and then uh, copy as path. And then we can uh, paste it in here, uh, here in quotation marks, and then we can just run it. And we can see that um, in a second, now it run and the word file will open. There's nothing in it because I just created some new files, but it's I can assure you that it's this word file. We can see here that it's the new word document. So uh, yeah, let me just uh, close this one down. Say that we wanna open perhaps like uh, all uh, word documents are here in this file uh, in this folder. Then we first we need to um, yeah let me just uh, create uh, the folder path of this folder as a variable. So uh, I just right click, not shift right click, just right click this time. Click properties, and then we will just uh, take this location and copy it. Go to variables, and then we will create a variable called str path. And then here in the default, we will uh, paste uh, the path in in quotation marks. So this one is just a variable of uh, this uh, folder path. You don't have to create it, it will just make your life a little bit easier. So um, then we could uh, perhaps, then we could um, use, have used it here, but now we will go on. So uh, yeah, then we will need a for each. We will drag this guy in here and we can uh, change this to for each file because um, it's files, it doesn't matter, you can use the items too, it doesn't matter, but this name is just, uh, but the uh, files is more appropriate. Then we will need to get all the files, so uh, then we will use the .NET uh, directory, get files, and then uh, in parentheses the path of our, our folder where we want to get the files. So now we just get, get the files and we will iterate through each of them. We need to change the type argument to a string. Let me delete this body sequence here. And then we can um, move this start process up here. And instead of uh, this folder path, then we just want to open every file that we find up here. And right now, it takes all files. But we only wanted to open the two uh, Word documents. So um, let me um, edit it up here. and. Um, what we'll do here is that we will um, comma, and then we will have uh, quotation marks, asterisk, and then DOCX, that's the ending of a Word document. And now we can run it. So what this does, it will iterate through all these files, and it will only take the Word documents, and then it will start the two Word documents. So let's see how that goes. We'll start UiPath, UiPath will run, and in a second, we will have the two documents uh, running. Um, we can see them here. The Word document 2 and 1. So that's the two guys here. Let me close these ones down. So now we show how we could open one specific. How we can open like all types of a Word document. Say that we want to open like all Word documents and all their Excel. Um, documents or files um, in the folder. So that's these, these two guys and this guy and this guy. Then we will use the concate, so dot concate here, and then parentheses, and then we'll just write this all over. So um, I can write it so you can see it again, but it's pretty much just the same. Directory, get files. This one will union uh, the two. And then str path here, comma, and then we will refer to all the X, Excel file, SLXX, like this, and the parentheses I think we'll need. That's it. This one will take an open, and this one will take the docs and the XLX, and then we can open these. Uh, it will uh, get uh, 
the all types of uh, these two files and then here we will open them. So now we will open four files. Let's see how that goes. UiPath will run and we can see Word starts up here, Excel starts up here and oh, let me drag it down here. We see we, we can see that uh, this new Microsoft Excel Reinach, that's in Danish, that's this one. This one is this one, and the two Word documents are also there. So um, now we only need to see how we can delete. It'll open all files in the folder, and for that we'll, we actually sort it in the beginning. So we'll just need to delete some of that we wrote here. And um, so now we'll just get every file here in this folder, and then we'll open it. We could also, if you want to delete the folders, or if you want to delete the files, you can just, instead of a start process here, you can just have a delete down here. So that will be the same. Now we will open seven different files. And uh, yeah, you can see that uh, it worked. The video is over. If you enjoyed it, please uh, like it. That will help me a lot. Only if you think it's good, of course. And um, besides from that, have a very good day. Bye-bye.